Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. In honor of heading out to Mexico in less than two weeks, I wanted to just make a little video recap about my previous incentive trip experiences. This is going to be my, oh gosh, I should have counted. Guys, this is actually going to be my 10th incentive trip with Perfectly Posh in four years. Gosh, I didn't even realize it had been that many. Anyway, I have um, luggage tags from all of the very exotic incentive trips that I have been on to commemorate each of the experiences. So I just kind of wanted to talk about each of the places I've been to share with you. And I keep them right here. My very first trip was to New York City and this was the luggage tag that we received. I went to New York City with Perfectly Posh um, within my first six months of joining. I was really um, fortunate to get a quick start with my business and earn this incentive trip. It was so much fun and I got to meet a bunch of new Posh sisters. It was on this incentive trip that I connected with Katrina Rimmel. She was my very first Posh best friend. We actually bonded over failed blowouts at the blowout bar in New York City. We were at um, a lunch through the incentive. It was a Cuban restaurant, which was to die for, and I wish I could remember the name of it to tell you guys because it was amazing. Anyway, I got invited into this small little group of, I think, six or seven people that were going to get blowouts. Somebody had canceled, so I took their spot. I was super excited, but also intimidated because I was around a bunch of top leaders, and I was a brand new posture. Who am I to be hanging out with these ladies? But they welcomed me with open arms. Halfway um, through the evening, we had just finished the blowouts. We were leaving the blowout bar, and I catch a glimpse of Katrina in the mirror, kind of doing one of these numbers, trying to fluff her hair, okay? So I walked up and I was like, yeah, our hair is kind of like flat, right? So we immediately bonded, like we just had dropped 60 or some odd dollars on a blowout and we had to go back to the hotel and do our hair before the party because the blowout was a fail. I mean, it wasn't the worst, but it wasn't the best. It was not $60 worth. Meeting Katrina forever changed my posh journey because I suddenly had a best friend that was kind of just on the same page as me. Connecting with Katrina helped propel me to my next incentive trip. I bet you've never seen one of these because there's actually only five in existence. I was the number one incentive earner in the next incentive. There's my little luggage tag from New York City. It was unbelievable. So when they first announced the incentive trip, it was the top 150 consultants that were going to earn a trip to St. Thomas. What's more than that, the top five consultants only would earn a dream photo shoot with Nigel Barker and a session with his glam squad. Hello, dreams come true. I remember it like yesterday, you guys. I was sitting in the audience at Uncon in Atlanta. They put up the, the screen about the, um, uh, the I was getting so excited. There was neon glow in the dark um, kayaks that you go kayaking at night at the resort. And it was just so exciting and it was the top 150 consultants. And I was like, oh my gosh, I can so do this. And then they brought out Nigel Barker and they announced that the top five consultants would earn that photo shoot. I'm like getting emotional just thinking about it because I immediately thought, oh, that would be so amazing. But I, I don't stand a chance at all at doing that. But guess what guys, I did it and it's, just so crazy, I did not expect to get emotional. My God, get it together. It was amazing because when it was announced, I immediately thought I can't do this. There's no way I can do this. There's you know, tens of thousands of consultants. I have no chance. And then kind of as immediate as I felt that way, I was like, no, I got this, I can do this. And I put my blinders on and I focused so hard on my business. I probably didn't take the best care of myself sleeping and eating wise, but I was focused on achieving and I, and I did. I was number one, which was so amazing. And anyway, blah, blah, blah. I received that soap and a whole bunch of other stuff um, for being number one. Plus I got to have the photo shoot and I'll insert a couple little clips from that because it was so much fun. It was literally a dream come true. <laughs> The photo shoot with Nigel Barker was for um, the centerfold of our catalog. I wonder if I have that. I should show it to you. 
where would my centerfold be? I found it! <laughs> that took me way too long. Here is my centerfold. I am on, I don't know what, it's always reversed. I'm in the white dress, there you go. <laughs> so after um, that photo shoot, we jetted off like two months later. This luggage tag, tan and Jan was the theme. We went to St. Thomas, it was really amazing. I roomed with Katrina and we had the time of our lives. St. Thomas, to this date, really truly is one of my favorite incentive trips ever. Um, next trip was Italy. This is my favorite luggage tag. I really wish that Posh would get it together and do these beautiful leather luggage tags every time because it's gorgeous. Italy was just absolutely breathtaking. They jetted us off to Europe. I think we were gone like eight days. We spent um, three days in Rome, three days in Florence. Oh God, my memory. <laughs> it was absolutely incredible. Everything that you can dream of about Italy and more. Italy was the very first time that I got a chance to room with Alyssa Brown and history was forever made. We are inseparable now. We had the most amazing time. We saw the Colosseum. We saw the Leaning Tower of Pizza. We saw, I know it's not pizza, but whatever. We saw all of the landmarks and we had a blast and we drank all of the wine. Um, what was next? Oh good, there's dates on these. The next incentive trip that was announced was to Costa Rica and they added an opportunity for you to earn a plus one. So, overachiever that I am, I earned Costa Rica and I earned a plus one. And when I started thinking, now who do I want to invite? Because when I had gone to my Nigel Barker photo shoot, I invited my mom and so she was able to join me on that trip and we had a ton of fun. But I was thinking when I go to Costa Rica, it's with the top 60 achievers. I'm going to want to hang out with my posh friends. I probably don't want to bring a man, right? <laughs> and I had so much fun with Alyssa in Italy that I invited Alyssa to be my plus one. So we did it off to Costa Rica together and we got an upgrade to first class for $99, which was such a steal. And we had the time of our lives. So Costa Rica was super fun and Pura Vida was the theme of that trip. It was at an all-inclusive resort. I did not love the food at all. And Sarah Kleinman, the one in the blue dress from the centerfold, <laughs> she brought me kind bars and saved my life. The next incentive trip that was announced. Change positions to keep it interesting for you. Greece! Can you believe they took us to Greece? It was an eight-day cruise on the Azamara cruise ship going from island to island in Greece, plus Turkey. It was literally a dream vacation. You guys, I am not a super fan of cruise ships because I'm really picky about food. <laughs> but I have to tell you, I was impressed with the food from the Azamara on our Greece cruise. We went to Mykonos, we went to, oh God, I can't even remember again with the memory. You know, all of the major Grecian locations and we had the time of our lives. It was only the top 40 that got to attend um, that incentive trip and I roomed with Katie Robinson. I already knew that she was a sweetie, but I had the time of my life. Katie is such a genuinely kind person. One night I had a couple too many beverages. That happens sometimes on posh trips. Anyway, I had several too many. I managed to get myself home. I went to bed like a good girl and apparently I woke up in the middle of the night around 2 or 3 a.m. and I called room service from the bathroom phone because we were in a fancy hotel and I ordered six Caesar salads. Six Caesar salads and a pitcher of ice water at 2 a.m. So then I come out of the bathroom and I get back into my bed and Katie, she's so cute, kind of pops up in her bed and is like, um, Jessica, were you on the phone in there? And I don't remember a whole lot, um, but I don't know what I said. And she was like, I think you were on the phone in there and I think you called and ordered six Caesar salads. You need to call them back immediately. <laughs> and I, I freaking love posh trips. I called them back and I said, I think I ordered six Caesar salads and I actually only need one. Just for the record, I needed none, but I told them I needed one. So the salad shows up. I roll it into the room and then I go right to bed. I never touched the freaking salad. Fast forward a month later when I get my credit card bill and I had to send Katie a little message. Hey, thanks so much for doing that because I just got my credit card bill and it was $36 for the one Caesar salad. 
I'm very glad that I did not order six. <laughs> the day after that whole incident happened, it was very early on in our trip when we were in Athens, we climbed to the top of the Acropolis. Whew, let me just tell you, that was a rough one. But I made it and it was amazing and it was breathtaking and Greece was just so super freaking fabulous. Okay, what was the next place I went? I don't know where my luggage tag is. Maybe they didn't give us one, but the next place we went was Punta Cana, Dominican Republic. That was just last year and it was actually, I think just exactly like a year ago because I've been seeing the um, flashbacks come up in my time hop. So much fun. That was in the Dominican Republic. Again, an all-inclusive resort. So much fun. We had a ton more. Um, I think, gosh, I can't even remember. I think a hundred people earned that incentive trip, maybe more. And so everywhere that you go on the resort, there's a posh sister, there's a posh sister, there's a posh tote bag. And you know what I just get into the habit of doing. So if you're coming to Mexico, this is going to be me. Hi, posh. Hi, posh. Hey, posh girls. Because, you know, that's just the way I make sure that everybody feels welcomed and that I say hi to everybody. I'm probably not going to know your name, but I'm going to holler, hey, posh. And I hope that you holler back. Anyway, like I said, in less than two weeks, we are headed to Puerto Vallarta, Mexico, and I could not be more excited. I'm actually going a couple of days early with Alyssa, and we are going to be staying in a house. So just hope that we stay safe. Just kidding. We're going to be staying in a local house, um, an Airbnb. It's a super host, so don't worry. We're going to be totally safe and smart and all of that fun stuff. Um, but I'm really excited to experience local living, go into town, la la la. That way when all of the posh girls show up and we're at the resort, it is all beach, all pool, all the time because that's how I like to vacation. How do you like to vacation? I am a total beach person. Are you a total beach person? I mean, I love New York City, but that's like a weekend trip, not a vacation. And I love Europe, but again, I'd rather be at the pool. Sue me. Not a history major here. Not interested in art. Judge me. I don't care. The other incentive trips that I've been on was Vegas, San Antonio. I think there was another one. I've started to lose track, guys. I'm almost embarrassed to say. The posh life is a good life. I can't complain. Anyway, that is just a little recap of some of my incentive trips that I've been on with Perfectly Posh. If you have any questions about incentive trips, don't you worry because I'm going to make a video telling you how to prepare for a posh incentive trip. And I can tell you it includes packing some random stuff like pool noodles and Bluetooth speakers. I hope you enjoyed learning about some of my fantastic vacations I've taken with Perfectly Posh. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. I sure do appreciate it. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss my next Jessica Posh video. I hope you guys have a super fantastic day and I will see you again.